Polio is back in the headlines. That's after the first case in the U.S. in nearly a decade. That case was in New York. It's a serious disease, but luckily millions of Americans are vaccinated against it. Fred Shropshire verifies three things to know about polio. Our sources include the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention, the World Health Organization, and Dr. Samina Evers with Novant Health. First, how does polio spread? The WHO and CDC say polio primarily spreads through fecal or oral contact, so it's a good idea to wash your hands before you eat to protect yourself. The second question, and we're seeing this one a lot from older folks, is about the polio vaccine given out in the 1950s. Some kids got it in a sugar cube, so through the mouth. Is the oral polio vaccine given out decades ago still effective? Yes, it is. It is no longer given because of the small risk in the population of spreading that attenuated virus, but it, it too is an effective form of being protected against polio. Quick vocab check, an attenuated vaccine means the vaccine contains a weakened form of a virus to help elicit a strong and long-lasting immune response. Okay, last question. Does the U.S. still use the oral polio vaccine? According to Dr. Evers and the CDC, the answer is no. Here's why. There was a very, very low risk, of like 1 in 2.4 million, that that oral polio virus, um, that vaccine that was given by mouth, could spread and cause polio. And so in 2000, it became routine in this country to use the inactivated polio vaccine, which is given as an injection in the arm or leg, and there is no risk of that sort of vaccine causing polio in the community. Some countries still administer the polio vaccine orally because it's easier and cheaper. And if you have a question or topic that you want our team to verify for you, send it our way. Just email verify at 13newsnow.com.